I'm a computer scientist and mathematician with an interest in marketing problems. And so I became a marketing professor. For more than a decade, I've studied internet marketing and e-commerce. And for the past five years, I've been focused almost exclusively on studying social media marketing. Three areas that I found are very important to organizations on social media and in marketing are strategy, customer acquisition and retention, and marketing spend. So I've done three papers on those topics. One which is in the Harvard Business Review is on strategy called What's Your Social Media Strategy and talks about different approaches that organizations use social media for effective practice. Another piece on customer retention and acquisition is on a concept I call connected customer lifetime value, where organizations should value not only the purchase that a customer makes, but also their influence and impact on the purchase decisions of other customers as well. And then a third piece that has to do with spend uh, provides guidelines and best practices for how to spend and allocate your budget on social media. I've been blessed with the research opportunities and expertise that I've been able to develop in social media. I have to bring that into the classroom. I want to bring that into the classroom to pass on that expertise to my students so that they're going to be competitive in the marketplace. And I want them to smoke the competition. I want them to get the best jobs and the best positions to be able to have the opportunities to do what they want. It's interesting in teaching social media marketing in class. What I see is, of course, as a professor, I pass along information and they, they learn from me. But what I see more so in this topic that I haven't seen in any other, and I can learn from everyone, but particularly in this one, I learn from them. And in fact, it stimulates research ideas for me to explore based on the, some of the things that they teach me or just our conversations about social media.